A sad day for family members of 10 years old Ntusan Godwin. The little boy dies in an explosion accompanied by flames in a bakery in Mabandadwala for subdivision. His mother, Nguwe Miwabel, who is unconsolable, recounts a tragic incident. The other son went inside and saw him. He came back now and cried for help before one neighbor went and carried him outside. They said that one of the workers then sent him to buy beer. <laughs> when he went, he bought the beer and came back now and gave them. That's when the thing exploded with him inside. According to an eyewitness, the explosion also caused the life of a baker who was in the bakery at the time of the incident. Before I could come here, I hear one of the workers die inside. Mm -hmm. That time now, Sape Pompe was here. There was a people that discovered that that one, has, that one worker has died there and then uh, one worker has an injury and went to the hospital. That other child is still in the hospital now, but it's not too bad that way. The little boy and the worker are said to have died at the Bonasama District Hospital. <laughs> I pleaded until they carry him to Vigo and next. When they went there, there was no oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> they went to Bonasama, no oxygen, no dust. When they said that we should take him to Lake Antony and he died on the road. The army rescue team alerted, descended on the scene to extinguish the flames, which was threatening to extend to nearby houses. It took the firefighters about three hours to contain the flames, resulting to enormous material damage. At the time of this report, two victims who were severely injured are receiving treatment in a health facility while investigations have been launched.